always try to be first with the news about new items or discounted items and icom have just announced an offer that runs through the whole of july for the id 50e handheld it's a great handheld it features both analog and digital modes so if you're thinking about trying d star this is a great way to get into d star but during the month of july there's a special offer now i did a video on the id 50e uh, some while ago so i'm going to show you now a few clips from that video that i did and if you want to pick up a bargain then this is the time to do it have a look on our website or pick up the phone speak to one of our guys and see what sort of deal they can do on the id 50e you know i do have to say that i really like the navigational system of the menus the menu items on this transceiver um, really mirror the navigation systems that uh, ICOM have used on all their recent transceivers. It's very easy, it's very logical. There's nothing hidden away, there's nothing complicated. Generally speaking, you can navigate through the menu systems and the titles give you a clue as to what it does. So that's very pleasing. I found that this mono screen is fine, it's very easy to read, it's very clear, and it's also very easy to read in bright light and it is backlit so if you want backlighting uh, and you can you can go into a time and switch it off after a period of time or switch it off completely but you can easily see this screen in daylight even in bright sunshine now as regards the bands you've got the two meter band and you've got the 70 sems band expect that on a dual band handheld but you've also got the air band, which I personally quite like because I've always been interested in aircraft and I find that being able to monitor aircraft is quite uh, a useful feature if you get bored with the hand bands. Get bored with the hand bands, Peter. Who could ever get bored with the hand bands? Well, sometimes you do, don't you? Anyway, you've got the air band on here and also you've got the broadcast, broadcast FM. So. It's quite a handy little transceiver. It's not only amateur bands, but if you're an aircraft enthusiast and you want to monitor the VHF air bands, then you can. And if you want to hear the latest news or whatever, or the latest music or whatever, then you can switch on the jolly old FM radio and you can justify this to your partner or wife saying that, well, it also acts as a bedside radio, darling. If you happen to drop your radio in the water, provided it's not deeper than one metre and you don't leave it in there for more than 30 minutes, <gasps> goodness gracious me, you should be OK. It's IPX7 rated. ICOM have now provided a USB-C charging socket and above that is a socket for an external power supply. Further up are another pair of connectors, the input for an external microphone and the output for audio. Now if we look on the other side, we've got a socket for a SD memory card. We've got the main on off button. We've got the squelch open button and we've got the press to talk button. On the top surface, there's a concentric control. The lower part controls the volume. The upper one controls memory settings, squelch levels, power level, etc. On the front of the radio, you've got six buttons, which gives you access to the various radio parameters and settings. You've also got a form of joystick, and that little button in the centre of the joystick is the enter button. The supplied battery is 1880 milliamp hours. The killer feature of this radio is the waterfall, at least in my opinion, it's the waterfall display. And it's helped me no end over the last couple of days when I've been playing around with the radio. I've been on the two metre band primarily, I had a listen around, and I've suddenly spotted a little blip on the waterfall display. And I've tuned down there and there's a, there's a signal, there's a station. Now, I wouldn't have known that station was there unless I had the waterfall display. It's got built-in Vox. It's got a built-in voice recorder in conjunction with the SD card. For those that are visually impaired, there's a button you press and it will read out the frequency for you, which is quite handy. You can send text via D-Star. You can have dual monitoring on two separate frequencies on the same band. And of course, the D-Star capability has been expanded. So there we are. Great chance to pick up this lovely little transceiver at a special price so don't miss out it runs through the whole of july and if you want to buy one of these 
go on their website or pick up the phone, speak to one of our sales guys. They'll be happy to do a deal. There we are. Don't miss out.